Hi, I'm Lorna Sass again, and this is part two of making a lentil soup and a chicken broth at the same time in the pressure cooker. We cook the soup for 20 minutes and let the pressure come down naturally. If you're in a hurry, you can just use a quick release method that you can read about in your owner's manual. There's still a tiny bit of pressure left in the cooker, which on this model I'm going to release by unlocking. Actually, it's pretty much all gone. And uh, I'm going to remove the lid and I'm always you want to remove the lid facing away from you just because there's a fair amount of steam as you can see in the cooker. Now uh, I'm going to look inside and we see we have our lentil soup and we're going to give it a stir. Now we have pieces of our chicken carcass in there so um, I think things are fogging up a bit, but you can see that the carcass has really broken up and um, the meat has fallen completely off the bone pretty much. What I can do once I've removed these pieces of bone, if there's any extra chicken, um, I can just put that back in the pot, which I will do, and also we have some roast chicken from last night, which I will probably add. Now, originally I was thinking of adding frozen string beans or frozen spinach. I always like to give a bright finish to my soups, uh, but I changed my mind. I often change my mind. And um, I found some uh, cilantro in the fridge, and so I chopped that up. And that, that's going to be a very nice flavor addition. To this kind of Moroccan style. We, if you remember, we added some cumin at the beginning and uh, some cinnamon. And I'm also just going to add for a bit of color some of the roast carrots that we had roasted along with the chicken. And I'm going to add salt to taste. And let me just ladle out a little bit of that soup for you so you get, sorry for all that clattering, um, you get a nice uh, picture of the color. Yeah, another thing I could add to this, which would be quite lovely, but I, I don't seem to have any in the house at the moment, is uh, a little bit of dried or fresh mint. So there you are, lentil soup in 20 minutes, and at the same time a very, very deep chicken broth flavor. Enjoy.